rotunda. Obviously, this is a huge victory for these protesters. They have disrupted the system in an enormous way. And I just want to, you know, bring everyone's reminder. Tweeted, someone's clearly gotten to him and said this is too much. Please support our Capitol Police and law enforcement. They are truly on the oh, side wow. of our country. Stay peaceful. Finally. Uh, yeah, finally. It's a little bit too late. We're just getting a report from Congressman Jim Himes that tear gas has been used right. inside the Capitol. Tear gas inside the U.S. Capitol. Uh, this is just an ass... John Hines earlier, uh, where the press had to be evacuated to the basement because there were some reports that uh, that some barriers were being broken by by protesters. And now you have a bit of a firestorm, Greta, where uh, on Twitter you're having a lot of people looking closely at the individuals who are breaking into the barriers and identifying them as Antifa. So you have a lot of uh, mixed messages coming out of what's happening right now. Um, questions about whether or not the people who are committing violence are actually MAGA supporters because traditionally they're pretty peaceful. So if there is a curfew tonight, we'll see. But again, it's always tough to talk about uh, a big crowd and what happens when a big crowd comes together. To accept reality, refusing to concede defeat, attacking every single Republican who gets in his way, including his own vice president. Pamela Brown, tell... Who's got the moves to dance their way to victory?